Good morning! As you can tell, it's a quiet house. <laughs> the girls are out right now with Auntie Mel and Auntie Val. But anyway, I just retweeted this article that Johnson's baby tweeted out and I didn't even know that Benji wrote this article. He wrote an article for the Today Show. I believe they partnered with Johnson's baby and he talked about the unconditional love that he receives from our babies and like I started tearing up. He is just it's so sweet. And I'll put that article link down below. I love Benji and I'm so blessed to have him. Not only as my husband, but the father of my children. Auntie Mel and Auntie Val are here today. So I'm gonna go to the gym. I've been going to the gym running. Actually, not that I've been going. I went once this past week because I totally fell off the bandwagon. I haven't been working out. Um, I've been eating better since, in general, compared to before but I have not been working out at all. Like, forget hot yoga. I'm not even doing hot yoga. But I'm trying to get into running. I feel like running is just a good full body workout. That's my plan. I wanna go to the gym and work on YouTube. I'm sitting in my office and I'm just looking at Judy's Facebook page and there's this video that is seriously hilarious. Was that yesterday? I forgot what day it was, but the girls, um, were left with me, which is not a new thing. I, I watch them all the time by myself. There's some people hating because they think that uh, I should have stopped it and I should, shouldn't have been filming. This is reality. I'm like a drill sergeant. I'm very disciplining. When I say disciplining, like order, um, treating everybody fairly. I don't ever let the girls fight. But in this case, and any parent knows, sometimes it's just too darn cute and you just laugh. I was just like laughing. I was on the phone, but in my, in my head, um, I was just laughing um, at the fact that these two were so caught up in their little toy and they have plenty of toys. And why was it at this moment that they both wanted to push this cart? Uh, it's just hilarious. I just love being a dad. And uh, these girls, they just, they put a smile on my face all the time. Yeah, I've been working in the office today. I'm planning on filming, finally. I just been slacking over there. Um, Austin hasn't been able to help me lately. He's busy. End of school. He's about to graduate. Congratulations, buddy. Anyways, uh, but yeah. Okay, let's read the directions together. We need a half a cup of milk. Can you say it loud? Milk. Yeah. So me and Auntie Val found the cutest little outfit. We're gonna go show mommy. Here, stand up. Can you stand up and spin for me? Go like this, do ballerina spin. Remember with your hands up? Hands <gasps> up. Whoa! That's okay. beautiful. Okay, let's go show mommy. So cute, she's got little tutu. I'm higher. Walk the right way, walk the right way. Hey. Mom. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Are you a Bella? Wow, look at that name. Oh my goodness, you're the most beautiful darling. <laughs> I'm not ready. I'm not ready. The muffins are ready? Yeah. So I just finished filming my 28 lip color palette review and swatches as you can tell I did quite a few swatches my lips actually don't feel too raw because 
It's not like this is a long-lasting lip color. In between like every four lipsticks, I would apply lip balm and this stuff is amazing. This is a Alba Pineapple Quench Lip Balm. Yeah, like I said, my lips don't feel raw after putting 28 different lipsticks on my lips. Oh my gosh, you know, come to think of it, I think you hear screaming babies throughout the whole video. No, actually, most of the video are swatches, so that's going to be muted in the background. <laughs> but they're they're having fun with Auntie Mel and Auntie Val right now. Anyway, I do want to get this video up tonight, so I'm going to work on this now. Uh, do you want to be a dancer when you grow up? Yeah. Do you want to eat muffins for the rest of your life? Yeah. <laughs> Me too. Auntie Mel, what do you want to be when you grow up? I want to be this muffin when I grow up. Can I do that? <laughs> <laughs> do you want to show Auntie Mel our Harry Potter ones? Wow. So what we have to do, this one is a snake wrapped around it. We just have to paint them. Slytherin. Ew! <laughs> you have an eyelash, can I get it? Can okay. I be a cat when I grow up? <gasps> All I have to do is sleep and eat. I want to be a sloth. I want to be a frog. You want to be a frog? A frog? That's a really good idea. I want, can I, ooh, I want, you ready? Yeah. Hold on to your pants. Hold on to your tutu. I want to be a mermaid. <gasps> mermaid she has flounder as Sebastian. She does. She probably has a flounder and a Sebastian. Yeah. You can't really be a mermaid without them. What do you think mommy wants to be when she grows up? I don't know. You don't know? Yeah. Can you guess? She wants to be a princess. She wants to be a princess? I think mom would make a really, really good princess. She wants to be Ariel. It is a little cloudy, but I'm just looking at this. All these green. I feel so lucky that I can walk in a place like this, whether at the park or just like along the street and have so much beautiful, luscious plant life and it's so green here in Washington. And you know, the downside of this area, it is raining all the time. The upside, everything just looks so beautiful. It's just so peaceful around here. And I can't imagine living in a city, unless I lived in a place like Central Park, where there was a huge park like that, that'd be awesome. But uh, I could never live in the city, especially after living out here. Yo, got Eugene in the house. We're picking up some coffee to film our video today. Yeah. You want to introduce yourself? I mean, oh. it's been a while since you've been in the vlog. Oh, for those who don't know me, I'm Eugene Cap, and I'm over at Comic Shop TV, which is a variety channel on YouTube. And Eugene and I go way, way back. I mean, we literally grew up together. We're just gonna do a video together. Yeah. Just thought, we planned this a long time ago, but we literally just came up with the idea today. It's an interesting one. I already mentioned it in vlog. Oh, uh, did you? Longevity. Longevity. Which. I think the reason I want to do it with you is because you have a goal of longevity that's even further than mine, and I never thought yeah. I'd ever meet anybody that had that goal. <laughs> that was our age. You just have to go subscribe to my channel. I do want to make this a Coffee Monday, so it won't be up till next Monday, but. Uh, we're just picking up some coffee right now, going through the drive-thru. I kind of like to relax, which is, Opposite of what coffee does for you, but like when I'm drinking coffee, I like oh. to just chill out. I used to do uh, monsters just because I had to be like on my toes for like the rap battles. <laughs> uh, old school rapper, right here. Not just like trying to like make music and stuff. Do you want to leave two straws on your hand? Um, uh, one? yeah, two straws. Two straws in the uh, cold Americano on ice. Just put one thin straw. Next week, mm. Benjamin and TV. And your channel? Comic Shop TV. Bam. For nerdy news. And then if you want to learn like video production and stuff, Cap and Design TV. I'm kind of nervous because Auntie Val is holding me responsible right now. <laughs> well, not really. She asked me to dye her hair, but it was easy for me because she had like the blonde on the bottom. So I just covered that with the hair dye. But we're gonna do the big reveal here in a few minutes. I should bring down my blow dryer too, so we can see what it really looks like. Okay. I told Val if it doesn't work out, or she even said she'll just dye it her hair all dark. But I think I'll look cute. That looks good. Oh, I'm so excited. But well, I haven't, I haven't really. This is a funny I have purple hair. I haven't. <laughs> So Benji and I are actually having an early dinner. We haven't even eaten 
very much today. We're gonna have dinner before the girls wake up. And she made ramen. The noodles in here? Oh, I was so confused. Oh, and the muffins that JB and Auntie Val made were delicious. Ooh, snap! We have steak here and some kimchi as well. You know what? I'm gonna need my bib. Ever since Tokyo, I can't eat ramen without spilling it on myself. So good. Thank you, honey. Mm. I was like, I'm, I gotta go do something in the office real quick. She said, no, cook now. <laughs> I was hanging. And then she mom. threw something at me. No. She was so hungry, I gave her the egg, the very last egg. Thank you, honey. We could share it. I ate a boiled egg. See, look at that. There were slaughtered everywhere. In Japan, it's appropriate to slurp your noodles. In fact, it's looked at as awkward if you do not slurp. Mm. Mm. Favorite place. This is so cute, Juliana showing daddy her ballerina outfit. Where did you get that beautiful ballerina? I don't know. I did this one. Can you do a um, ballerina twirl for daddy? Mm-hmm. Whoa! <laughs> so cute. Ah, oh, you're doing that. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, Miss Ballerina, let's go pee-pee in the toilet. I'm a, I'm a baby. You remember that? Every time the girls come up now, they always point, Daddy, Mommy, at the pictures. And you know, we really got to put Mia and Kira in these photos. Like, we just never get around to it. And it's so sad. Like, Daddy, there's no photos Daddy, of them. Daddy, baby. It's a baby. Who is that? I don't know. That's you. Oh, it's like Brody Baby. It's like Brody Baby, you're right. Kira's been extra clingy ever since I got back. Can I see that smile again? Look at your teeth. You got daddy's teeth. So I'm making some green juice, and today we've got four ingredients. Spinach, Daddy, hi, Daddy. apple, hi! Mommy, homie, we're Oh, okay, yeah, good job. 
In addition, we've got lemon and apple juice and then just ice and water like usual. It was wondering a, who we're talking to right now. <laughs> <laughs> it's the internet. <laughs> yeah, the internet. Like, internet. <laughs> <laughs> 